Now, let's leave the conference hall for a moment and join Diana Medill. And we're here in the Floral Hall. We're listening to reaction of Robin Cook's speech from a number of Eurosceptics, or people who are not that happy with the way things have been going. We've got Jeremy Corbyn MP, Roger Berry MP, and we're also joined by Peter Shore, who you saw leaving the hall a short while ago. So, Jeremy Corbyn, what's your problem with the way that Roger Cook is... Uh, Roger Cook, I was going to say. <laughs> Robin Cook is, is handling Europe. My concern is that we need to be very robust against the conditions for the single currency. A single currency would lead to enormous cuts in public expenditure in Britain and a very rapid rise in unemployment. Now, he appeared to make some tilt in that direction. The other one is a concern about democracy in Europe. We have a European bureaucracy totally unaccountable to anybody. Powers have gone from national parliaments. They haven't gone to the European Parliament. They've gone to the Commission and, to some extent, to the Council of Ministers. These are quite serious matters. People argue against there being a, a drop in public expenditure by saying that there will be economic growth to compensate. Well, I've heard that argument before, but the reality is we have more poor in Europe per head than any, almost any other country. The number of people in real poverty is increasing, and the kind of cuts in public expenditure envisaged by the Maastricht criteria would lead to massive, in, a massive increase in poverty and unemployment employment in Britain. You cannot wait for growth. You have to deal with the issue of poverty now.